Welcome to the QuickBooks University. My name is Matt Holtquist. In this video, I wanted to go through class tracking. Okay, this is an important feature of QuickBooks uh, that a lot of people don't know about or they don't really know how to use it. Okay, so first of all, class tracking is a way to track uh, certain parts of your business or certain divisions, so to speak. And so when you set up these different classes, uh, you assign income and expenses to those classes so that you can pull up a report that shows you, uh, you know, it could be a profit and loss by class. Okay, I'm going to show you an example of that. All right. So the first thing we want to do to set up class tracking is go to the edit drop down menu and we're going to go to preferences. Okay, and under the accounting option, if you go over to company preferences, you're going to see this option here class. Use class tracking for transactions and prompt to assign classes. Okay, I always like to check this box off that way. Uh, I make sure to assign transactions to certain classes. Okay, so you click OK. And if uh, in this sample file, if I go to the list drop down menu, you're going to see an option here class list. Okay, and in this particular uh, company, they have new construction, remodel, and overhead. Okay, so these are the classes. And the goal when you set up class tracking is to assign everything to a class. So some um, companies will set up, okay, we have, you know, for example, new construction and remodel. So we want to see profit and loss by new construction and by remodel. But some expenses are just for overhead. Okay, so we're going to assign those just to that class. Okay, and those are the ones that generally are just allocated between the two and aren't really associated specifically with new construction or remodel. Okay, all right. So once you set up your classes, okay, uh, any time that you go in, let's say that we want to create an invoice. Okay, so we're going to create an invoice for Christy Abercrombie's family room. Okay, we're going to... Um, exclude outstanding billable time. Okay, so right here, you're going to see a class. Let's say that this is remodel. Okay, and we're going to, uh, let's say, do planning. And we're going to say that it took 15 hours of planning at 60 bucks an hour. Okay, so there's our invoice $900. All right. Okay. So now we assign that to the class, okay? And you can do the same thing when you uh, enter a bill, okay? So let's say that this is a vendor of, you know, let's say uh, Daigle Lighting, okay? We've got open purchase orders, but the, let's say this is 425, and we're going to put this to, um, mm, we'll say these are job expenses, and we'll say job materials, uh, customer job, family room, and right here, we're going to put in a class, remodel. All right. Okay. So again, every transaction gets assigned a class. Okay. So here's where this shows up then. If we go to the report center and we want to pull up a profit and loss by class. Okay. So now you're going to see after all these transactions have been um, uh, uh, you know, classified, you're going to see this P&L by class. So we've got the new construction uh, income and expenses. We've got the remodel. And then we've got the overhead where things, you know, fuel, insurance, repairs, and maintenance, not specific to remodel or new construction. And then, of course, you're going to see the unclassified transactions that you want to double click and go into and make sure that you assign these to a class. Okay. So class tracking is a great way to look at different segments of your business. So you set up your general chart of accounts. So you have a, you know, certain income accounts, but if that income account could apply to two different divisions or classes, this is when you're going to use class tracking. All right. It's a great way to track your business. All right. All right. If you have any questions whatsoever, Leave a comment here in the video. We'd love it if you shared the video and liked it. And uh, if you want to learn more and learn everything you need to know about QuickBooks to take your business to the next level, head on over to the QuickBooks University where you also receive not only 
uh, training tutorials that show you everything you need to know, but also one-on-one -on -one support uh, for your specific situation from me. Answer all of your questions. Head on over now, qbuniversity.org.